Benin's functionaries announcing the presence of the Benin monarch who came out in his royal splendor to receive homage from his subjects at a Twiguaba ceremony held at the palace of the Benin monarch as part of activities marking the 2014 Anwa Uge Festival. The Enige Ohe palace chiefs, palace functionaries, children and grandchildren of the Oba of Benin and others converged on the palace of the Oba of Benin to honor the monarch Oba Ediawa. <laughs> The Oba of Benin, His Royal Majesty, Obae Diawa, in his love and appreciation for his people, gave the chiefs a nigi, including his first daughter, Kolanos, with which they will perform their Igwe festival in their various homes. The Osama of Benin, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawao Igbinejian, also received Kolanos from the Oba of Benin as the Ejion Noe. Osama. <laughs> Osama. <laughs> Colorful a coconut masquerade also added color to the Otuiguaba ceremony. The Sama of Benin, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawarik Benajan, while wishing the Omonoba reign in good health and long life, describes the Otuiguaba as significant in the life of the Benins and thanks God Almighty for witnessing another Ugi festival. Igwe festival, today one of the most important day in Benin. You should thank God Almighty for what he has done for you. God have also blessed me to see this year. Other chiefs speak on the significance of the Twiguaba ceremony and Uge festival. The chiefs come to greet the Oba preparatory to his own Igwe. We want to thank God that we have an Oba who reign very peacefully. The Oba gives kola notes from Kedar to Kedar, from title to title. And the significance is that the Oba is telling the Benin people that he, in his majesty, appreciates the service of the Benin people. Also present at the ceremony were the wives of the Benin monarch who graced the ceremony in beautiful royal outfits. <laughs> Deborah Ogbefun reporting.